Hi everybody, this is Mike with Bee Rescue. I thought I'd take a minute and show you guys some of the different things that we bring with us when we do a, an assessment on a colony. So one of the first things that we're gonna do is we're gonna use most likely either an alcohol uh, mite wash to check to see the Varroa mite load. Uh, depending on the customer's preference, we might sometimes use uh, a sugar roll. So we use the uh, University of Minnesota standards for that. But uh, we also have treatment options we bring out with us. A lot of times we'll have the treatment options on us uh, to save a trip charge. So we might put some Apovar in. We might use, this is a Provap 110. Great tool for oxalic acid sublimation. It's not actually vaporization, but sublimation. I also have uh, some non-chemical options like the Thermal Industries uh, uh, Thermal Hive Treatment. I've got, usually carry a uh, eight frame and a 10 frame version of that. Also, some other devices that I bring along. This is called a uh, guardian entrance, and this helps keep out small hive beetles. Less of a problem this time of year as temperatures cool off, but can be a little bit more of a problem later. Uh, the other things I have, you know, just the general items like a smoker, you know, measuring cups, funnels, an inverter in case I need some power to run the uh, thermal boards. The uh, ProVap, however, isn't going to run on that little converter. We have to use a bigger converter for that. But uh, anyway, carrying along some Swiffers, extra gloves, even an extra veil or two, some screens and things like that. Just extra stuff in case we need it to help a client. Our goal is to educate and help our customers be as successful with their bees and beekeeping as possible while we're out uh, teaching the world about the importance of honeybees and pollinators. Anyway, so there you go. There's some of the equipment that, uh, that we use at Bee Rescue. Thanks.